I'm back with so many more new things. If you guys could not tell by the title, I got some more Timu. And you know, you know, I I just um I really appreciate you guys when you come and watch these videos. I don't necessarily always do review videos on this channel, but you guys know I've been working with Timu for a while and I love them so much. So I appreciate you guys coming to support this and watching. Um, just wanted to get that out of the way. Also, I wanted to quickly give a disclaimer that I have taken everything out of their parcels as to not trigger anyone. Okay? Okay. So, I want to go ahead and get started. I have so many things. I have office things. I have electronics. I have some pet things. I have some makeup things. And I have some clothing. I'm also waiting on another package to get here tomorrow. I couldn't wait. I wanted to show you this stuff um, while I have it because it's a good handful. So I figured I would break it up into two different videos if that's okay with you. But I'm going to go ahead and get started. Like I said, I'm excited and I've got a lot. So if you're nosy like I am, I just always go and watch everybody else's Timu hauls just to see if there's something out there that I've not come across and that I desperately need in my life. Now, if you've been here for a while, you guys know that unless somebody is beside me to smack my hand and tell me, no, you don't need that, Mandy, I'm going to get them. T-shirts. We're going to start off strong here. This is going to be my summer 2023 motto. The only BS I need in my life is beer and sunshine. And I stand by that. This is a extra large. It's an extra large. I like my stuff to be roomy. Uh, the material is really, really nice and um, stretchy, kind of, so it gives. Love it. The next t-shirt that I got reminds me a lot of my mom. She says this a lot, and when I saw it, I said, well, I, I, I need that. I've got to have that. Again, it is an extra large. Not my first rodeo. Y'all, the color of this is really, really nice, too. It's like a, like a dusty taupey rose and it's also stretchy love it extra large um uh, short sleeved i needed i didn't need this i didn't need it but i wanted it okay i wanted it so i got it um also i'm gonna have all of the pricing and everything on the screen i will also have all of the links to everything that i've got in the description box so don't forget to go and check that out. But before I get too far into this and show you my next ensemble, I want to let you guys know what Timu is. Just in case you did not know, Timu connects you with millions of sellers and manufacturers so that they can bring you the most affordable quality products at wholesale prices. They offer everything from makeup, clothing, electronics, pet supplies, kitchen gadgets, you name it, they've got it. They also have safe payment options from PayPal and GPay, Apple Pay, Afterpay, Discover, pretty much anything that you've got, they will take it as far as payment. They also have guaranteed deliveries, security and privacy protection on your account. They also offer free 90-day returns and the customer service is immaculate. So if you have never been on Timu's website, I highly recommend you go and check them out as soon as you finish watching today's video. You must be living under a rock if you've never seen it come across your Instagram, YouTube, TikTok, whatever, because they are literally just blowing up all over the internet and I'm really excited to be a part of it. Okay, so the last piece of clothing that I have in this shipment, if you guys have been you know, on the internet, you keep, or I keep seeing, I know probably some of you guys have too, the little infomercials coming by with the really pretty uh, girls with the really cute little one-piece rompers for the summer. Well, I decided I was going to have me one too, okay? So I got this in gray. I believe it is in an extra large, and it looks, it looks like it should work. Um, the material is really nice. I know you guys can't see it. Anyway, and it's got the little pants, right? Right? I'm looking at my little thing right here. I, I know I shouldn't do that, but I just want to make sure that I'm getting all of this in the, uh, you know, screen for you guys to see. At some point, I will try this on and let you guys know how that works out. You guys will have to follow me over on Instagram, and I will show you how that all um 
worked out for me. All right, so the next thing that I want to show you guys is the makeup things that I got, skincare, makeup, and all that jazz. So I needed a new makeup bag, and when I saw this one, I really liked the way that it unfolded, if that makes any sense. So when it comes, you know, zipped just like this, this is how it looks. Isn't that pretty? So the handle's up on top just like normal, and then it just, you know, unzips from the side. And then you open it, and it lays flat. How cool is that? So you've got two compartments on each side, and then you've also got these little um, spaces on the outside so that you can keep things, and another zipper in the middle. They do have different colors of these. I really liked this darker color, and it kind of has like that Louis Vuitton print on there, which is so bougie. I love it. Um, but I really liked this, and I needed it. I got the last makeup bag that I got... Um, is when we went to the beach last year last year and I liked it but it's like filthy dirty and this one you can like wipe off the other one that I have is cloth so I really wanted something like this uh, really cute and I cannot wait to put everything in this one I also decided to try where's my black one I thought I got a black one but I guess I didn't I might be losing my marbles anyway I decided to try some of these little uh, triangle poofs, puffs for your powder and your makeup. These are really, really soft. And this one came in a pack of six, I think. I think. I haven't tried them yet. Because when I get ready for work in the morning, it's like 5.36 o'clock. I really am not caring about this that early. On the weekend, when I have time, I'll try it and I'll let you know. But I will tell you that they're extremely soft. So you're supposed to like put your setting powder and things like that. I love it. And so cheap. Not this, but you know, price-wise. So affordable. Affordable. That's it. The next little um, piece of makeup that I got is this Charlotte Tilbury dupe for the contour. They had like three different color sets, I think, and I actually did try this out the other night, just like in my bathroom, and the color was great. Um, so I'm not one that will spend $1,000 on makeup, but this is super affordable as well. So it has just like the little felt top on it. I don't know if you can see. It's got the little felt tip. And then you just dot, 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 wherever you put all of your contour. And then you just blot it out, smooth it out. I want to say they had blush too, but um, this one I really liked. And I will probably be purchasing it again. Um, but yeah, Charlotte Tilbury dupe. I will never do that again. Never. Sorry, I apologize. I'm sorry. Okay, so the other thing that I got is this really cute little strawberry lip mask. And it comes in this little, like, uh tub and it's got one of those really cute little like honey dipper spoons with it can you see this how cute is that so we'll tell you that i have tried this already um and i love it absolutely love it it smells ugh, it smells like strawberry shortcake not the food like the doll don't eat it you're not supposed to eat it hmm It feels so good too. So I put this on at night before I go to bed and my lips feel amazing when I wake up. You're gonna wanna lick this and eat it, but don't do it, it'll make you sick. But it smells so good. And I think they had, what else did they have? Maybe coconut? No, if they had coconut, well, I, would, I would've gotten coconut. I don't remember which other flavors they had, but I got strawberry, super, super nice, and a really good lip mask for the evening. Okay, now I want to show you some of the things that are like office type things. Um, if you guys have been following me on Instagram, you guys know that I have gotten back into my reading. This is currently what I'm on right now, and I needed some bookmarks. So I went into the search bar and looked for bookmarks, and they had some of the cutest things ever. So I found these little leather um, hearts, and I think this one came in a pack of two. But this is what they look like. They just open up on the end, and then you just put some pages in there, and it keeps your place in your book. How cute. How cute. I think I ordered a couple different ones, and those must be coming in the next shipment, but I will show them to you as soon as they get here. 
The other thing that I got for my book is, I don't even know what these are called. Um, if you guys know, you know when you see it. So it's this little thing here. Look how pretty the colors are. Isn't that pretty? So basically what you do is you like put it on your thumb or your finger like this and it will hold your pages open for you so you don't get like thumb cramps. How cool is that? But they had a ton of different like colors of these and um, I'm probably going to get like a couple more just to have laying around just in case I'm in different books. Um, I normally don't do that because I get confused a lot. It's very easy to confuse me, but these are really cute and they have saved my thumbs tremendously. The next thing that I decided to pick up is this stylus pen. It's just like the Apple pen. I have not tried it yet. I will try it um, to use this for my iPad. I did open it and look at it just to make sure that it looks the same and it does. Um, I do need to charge it and try it out for you guys and I will let you know but it does come with the charger and an extra little tip here but this is what it looks like it's got the little button on top and it looks just like the apple pens but I'm not down for paying apple pen money so I was really excited to see that on the website because I have always wanted to do like the little illustration things that I always see people doing on their iPad but I didn't have a pen so now I have one now I can you know, draw. So these next things, I don't know why I got so excited when I saw them, but they're little post-it notes and they're clear. Um, this kind right here comes in a different, like four or five different little um, types. Like, um, what do you call it? They don't all look like this. Like they have different writing on it and stuff like that. Anyway, I got the ones that kind of look like a little notepad and it says just notes at the top of it and they are sticky but when you pull them off they're literally clear isn't that cute so it just has date and message written up there really really cute so going along with that i got two more packs of just regular there's nothing written on them they're just regular clear post-its see super cute I thought that I could use these like for reminders and things and I can put them on my desk and they won't look like all gaudy, you know, with post-its. Really, really cute. Um, and I'm also going to take some to work to use there too. Now this next thing, um, I have not tried yet, but I'm going to attempt to try it now. And if you guys have been seeing it online, you're going to be like, really? But I have been in the position where I've this could be really useful, okay? So it's one of the little TikTok rings where you can just Bluetooth it to your phone and all you have to do is push the button and it'll go ahead and scroll it for you. I'm gonna see if I can get it connected and try it out. Again, I have not tried it. I just had it charging. Um, let me turn this on and see if I can get it connected really quickly. So it is kind of working. Um, if you push like the long button, it does do your volume. If I double click it, it goes back to the home page. And if I click it once, it goes back to the video that I was just watching. I need to read the little thing and try to figure out exactly what I'm doing, but it synced right to my phone and it did work with TikTok. So I will go back through the, um, manual and see if I can't figure it out but how cool is that I mean it's making it really really hard for me to um, not be as lazy <laughs> okay so the next thing that I got um, which is kind of like office I ended up seeing these and I thought this would be a great gift for my dad um, so it actually is just like a little keychain and then inside the keychain it has guitar picks and my dad's a musician he does play guitar which is really cool but what is even cooler about these is they all have um let me see if i can show you they all look the same but they're all guitar picks of the beatles and my dad is a huge beatles fan so i thought that was so cool that they would have something of the beatles on their website uh, i tried to find other things i wasn't able to but I definitely grabbed these up. I hope he doesn't watch this before I can give them to him because it's going to ruin the surprise. But I thought those were so neat. So 
Definitely had to get those. Okay, so I've got a pile of like household stuff. I'm not sure if they all really go into the same category, but let me go ahead and show you what I've got. So I ended up grabbing this. Um, it was actually in the pet section. Now I've had one for myself. Um, and I never thought about using something like this for Bodhi in the bath. Let me open it really quick. But it's just one of these um, little massagers that you can just like hold. These little bristles are really, really soft. But it's supposed to like really help get the suds and get down, you know, in all that fur. So I definitely need something to help me uh, when I'm trying to give him a bath to get down in there. I usually use like little neoprene gloves and that does help get like extra hair and stuff off of him but this is supposed to help with that too and i need all the help i can get so i think he's really going to enjoy this little massage i'll let you know how he likes this when i try it something else that i got for Bodie, um <laughs> he's not let me put them on him yet i don't know what in my mind thought that he would let me do it um but i saw them and i had to have them it's little booties, okay? So what I'm thinking is like when we take him down to the creek and stuff, you don't know what's under that water and I'm always afraid that he's gonna step on something and like cut him or hurt him or something like that really bad. So I decided to get these these booties with this little drawstring on it. So you just use the drawstring to tighten it up around his legs. I don't even know if they're gonna fit him. He's got some big old feet and now that I'm looking at him, I'm not sure if they will. But my sister has a dog and I think she's a little bit smaller than Bodie, so these might work for her. But yeah, I've got four little doggy booties. I'm gonna try, I don't know. He's usually pretty patient with me as long as I have a treat that he knows he's gonna get after I humiliate him with something. He's usually pretty good about letting me try it, but his feet is a different story. So I don't know if that's gonna work or not, but I will definitely give you an update on that. The other thing that I got for Bodie, I actually got two of these, the little lick mats, and they've got these suction cups on the bottom of them. I like to use these in the tub to keep him occupied. Also, um, like in the summer, you can put like yogurt and fruit, all kinds of stuff on here and throw it in the freezer and let him go to town on that. And it's like a treat for him. And it really, uh, it wears him out. So apparently like sniffing and licking and stuff like that for dogs is like the equivalent to 30 minutes of straight running and he needs all the help he can get with getting his energy out so i love these things we do use them all the time and it's a great price so i went ahead and grabbed two of them the next thing that i got i have not taken out of the plastic yet but i plan to use this very very soon and what it is it's a little tube that you connect to your vacuum that you can stick down into your lint trap in your dryer and it'll vacuum all that stuff out so I've had one of those little brushes like with the hard bristles on it that you can just like stick down in there but it doesn't seem like it really gets it all and then when you get it out it's all stuck to the bristles and it's hard to get off of there so I thought I would give that a shot um, it looks like it will fit the other thing is about my lint trap thing it's really narrow so not a lot of things I can stick down in there but this looks like it'll fit uh, perfectly. I'll let you know. I'm excited to try this. So these I got for the couch. I actually picked up two of these. One of them um, is currently in the living room, but it's these little fabric cushion covers. Does that make sense? They're elastic and they're in different colors. So these are square. You can get them in square and then like a really long one like for a chase side. So I do have one on my couch right now um, and it works perfectly. The only thing is the end of my cushion kind of wraps around the arm in the front. So it's a little oblong. So this doesn't fit perfectly, but it's not this thing's fault. It's my couch. And I didn't realize that I had those little long ends on the front, um, but we're still using them. So it keeps the dog hair off of them. It keeps them as clean as they can. And then you can just pop them off and put them in the washing machine. They did have different colors. I think this is the cream colored. Um, and they're really soft. I like them a lot. I did catch Bodie on there laying on it. Which I actually wasn't mad about because I had my couch covered and protected. So he enjoyed it. He thought it was really soft. These are really nice like to protect for pets or anything like that. I'm really glad I got these. I'm definitely going to keep using them, even though they kind of fit and kind of dull. They still fit, but just not as perfect as they would. 
other ones. So I also noticed when I was putting dishes away like a few weeks ago that my whisk has gotten that rusty stuff on it and I was like, eh, no, I don't want that anymore. So I found this and it's a plastic whisk and it's flat, but you turn it on the bottom and it becomes an actual whisk. Look at that. How cool is that? These come in different colors too. It's plastic, so it's not gonna rust. It is dishwasher safe and it will flatten out to um, fit in your drawers better. Everybody needs one of these. So this is something that I've actually been wanting for a while. You guys know I have back issues. I'm always complaining that my back hurts. So I saw this and decided I wanted to give it a shot and it is a back stretcher. So it has these little knobs on here to kind of like massage both sides of your vertebrae. It says on the website that if you use this like five to 15 minutes every day, it will help stretch out your back. I have been using it, Ruben has used it, and it really does feel good, it really does help. So it has like three little slots. If you um, put it on this first slot, it's a little bit flatter. I have it on this middle spot, but then you can also put it back here and it will make the arch bigger. I really like it. I'm glad I got this because I always need to like stretch my back out and I never really know like a good way to do it. I, when I was younger, this is probably what's wrong with my back. When I was younger, I would sit and twist and pop my back. Don't do that. You'll pay for it later. <laughs> but this is really good just, you know, like to have at home and just lay down and stretch your back out. Really good. Really, really nice. I like it. So I also grabbed this little placemat. I thought it was really cute and I recently got a little fruit bowl to put on my kitchen table and I wanted something to put underneath it so that it wouldn't scratch and this kind of matches everything that I've got going on in there. I think they come in different patterns. I'm almost positive they're different patterns, but I did grab this one because it's kind of, you know, like I said, goes with all the stuff and it is machine washable. I'm just, I don't know how it's going to dry um it is 100 percent polyester so we'll find out hopefully i'll never have to wash it but i thought it was really cute and it's a perfect size to put under my fruit bowl all right y'all when i ordered this i was so excited and you guys know i've had so many great things to say about timu and it, nobody's perfect and i will always give you my honest opinion okay so this just might be my experience i'm not trying to shy you away uh, but you guys know if you've you know been on the internet these things are going around like hot cakes okay hot cakes so this is the tote bag it's really cute really cute i love the color they have a ton of different colors but do you see anything about this that's a little off this little a right here this little a right here is a little off and i'm bummed about it but it's okay it probably just happened in manufacturing or whatever. I'm still going to use it. I'm still going to be carrying my stuff to work in it. It is a really nice sized bag. I can fit so I can fit my actual person here. I can fit my books, my lunch, my iPad, whatever, all in here, my umbrella. It also comes with a shoulder strap. I don't use it. I don't like a shoulder strap on a on a bag this big, but I like this. If it weren't for that A, it would have been perfect. It's okay, girl. Nobody's perfect, but we're just going to roll with it. I really like it, um, but don't let this deter you from ordering one. Like I said, I feel certain they're not all this way. This one just happened to probably turn out that way in manufacturing, but I love it. I love the purse either way. All right, last but not least, I have some electronics that I wanted to show you guys. So I did need a shower radio. I've had a few and I don't know what happened to them. I honestly don't know. So this is the TNG wireless portable speaker and you can connect it through Bluetooth. Um, you know, pretty much, you know how, you know how to work these things. I got the gray one and it's, it's really nice. It's heavy and it has a little loop on here with the rubber top. That way you can hang it on your little shower hooks or, uh, I don't know, wherever you want to put it. But I did really need one of these. I uh, have not used it yet. And I'll show you what I've been using in my bathroom because this one is the same uh, company, the TNG. Look how cool this is. 
Okay, so the, the sound on this is amazing. We've been doing some porch sitting because the weather's been great. We've been sitting outside with the dog um, and really just enjoying the evenings. And I've had this outside and I love this. So I'm gonna turn it on and I'm gonna show you what like all the little lights do. Bluetooth mode. Yeah. I don't know if you can see it. Okay, so anyway. On the top here, it's got a little button that you can push for the light mode, like how you do the lights. So this is just really going through the motions and this will, you know, isn't that cool? Just like a different little each color. Um, I don't think I'm giving you a good, can you see this? I probably should put this in the dark. I don't know. Anyway, it's so cool. It does all these different things. It'll also go to the beat of the music as well. I, I just get really, it doesn't take much. It doesn't take much. I love this thing and the sound of it is really, really, really good. If you need something like for the outdoors or anything like that um, and you don't want to spend a ton of money, please do me a favor and get this. You're, just for the light show alone, worth it. Worth it. So you guys also know that I have ordered a couple sets of earphones uh, from Timu, and I have been so pleasantly surprised. I just wanted to see if it was just my luck or if all of them are as good as my other ones were. So Lenovo was the other brand that I got um, that I loved so much. And I decided to get um, three different other pairs so, I don't know if you guys have seen the bone conduction, I think that's what they're called. Um, these are really neat. I'll show you what they look like. They kind of look like, I don't know, I'll show you. So, this is what they look like, and this is all that you have to do. So, on this side is the actual speaker, and this side is what goes um, on the outside of your ear, and then it's got like this little fingerprint here to where you touch and it does like all of the magic stuff so the speaker part you obviously put in your ear and then the other side goes on the outside so you just clip it on the outside of your ear I'll show you like that you just clip it on kind of like a little ear cuff so what happens is everything all the music that comes through your earphone you can hear everything and it's really nice but you can also hear things outside so for an example at my work we allow people that work in the plant to wear earphones but we ask that they keep one of them out just in case an alarm's going off you know for safety reasons they need to hear what's going on these would be perfect because you can still hear everything around you but you're still getting your music and stuff does that make sense some people don't like that because they want to have you know all the sound just in their ear um, and kind of like you know block everything else out but if you're in a situation to where you kind of you know do need to hear everything around you these are great the sound is amazing I love these I love wearing these around the house when I'm cleaning that way if my phone rings or the dog barks or anything like that I can hear the next ones that I got are also from Lenovo. These are the Think Plus Live Pods GM3. I think these are the newest ones that they have out. I have not opened these yet, but I'm really excited to because they look really, really cool. And last but not least, I got the Think Plus. I can't remember the exact. These are like the step down from the one that I showed you. I got these for Ruben and he really likes them too. This is what these look like. It also shows you the battery power on the top. It's like this little mirror right here. So I think that's pretty cool too. Ruben has used these uh, quite a few times when he was out mowing the other day. Um, and he said that he really liked them. They were very easy to connect to his phone and very comfortable. So win-win. I would say pretty much anything in there as far as the Lenovo line, hands down some of my most favorite products to date from Timu. So that is all that I have for today's haul. Make sure to come back and check out my next haul. That should probably be here and done, I'd say within the next week or so. So if you're not subscribed and you wanna come back for that one, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and make sure your notification bells are on so that way it'll bring you 
right back here to me as soon as that video goes live. But I really appreciate you guys again. Don't forget to go and check out Timu. All of the information will be in the description box. Also, don't forget to use that coupon code if you are a first-time buyer. But thank you so much. I hope you enjoyed the haul. Let me know in the comments down below what your favorite thing was that I got this time. I gotta go. I love you and appreciate you, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.